Hi everybody, this is Barney Davey and I'm here today to talk to you about my new book, Guerrilla Art Marketing, How 100 Collectors Can Bulletproof Your Art Career. It's my belief that most artists these days are not spending their time and their marketing dollars wisely. They're chasing too many different opportunities, not putting their emphasis on the right areas all the time, and not getting synergized efforts from their marketing. In other words, they're not layered and amplified. This book shows you how to do all that and a whole lot more. It starts off with talking about career goals. Where are you going? What do you want? It doesn't matter what it is. There are no right answers here, but you do need to know deeply. This is what I want from my career in five years, in 10 years, in a lifetime. The more that you can define this, the more clearly that you can see this, the easier all the other decisions that you need to make regarding your career are to accomplish. I believe that you should have a goal of 100 collectors. That's over the course of a 25 year career, that's four in a year or 12 and a half years, you can get to that number by getting eight collectors a year. If you are concentrating on selling direct, that's the most important part of your marketing campaign, your marketing component, then you can get there. How fast is up to you? It's definitely possible. What that does for you is bulletproof your career, and I'll tell you why here in a moment. You also need to learn how to assess your resources. How fast do you make your art? How fast does it sell? What do you get from the sales? What's your profit? How much money do you have to invest in your business? Do you have some help? Can you hire an assistant? And what is your own marketing experience? Everybody's got a different story here, so everybody's going to have a slightly different outcome. But the more you know about yourself, and your capabilities with regard to these things, the easier it is to know where you are now and know what you need to do to get to where you really want to go with your career financially and career achievement wise and everything else. The more you know this in, instinctively or just within yourself, the more successful you're going to be faster. I believe that your true success with your 100 collectors is going to come right in your own backyard. Is this applying 100%? No, but it does probably 90%. People like to buy from people they like. Just makes sense. The people who are going to be easiest for you to sell then are people who already know you. The next easiest people are those people they know, and the next easiest beyond that is the people that those people know. You work out from a warm market to local market to regional market. You can become a hero, slightly famous in your own region by doing things that I suggest to you in the book that means that people not only buy from people they like they like to support hometown or local talent that's got that's gotten good that's become somewhat famous and you can do that totally within the realm of possibility you do that by smart networking that means you identify by researching in advance who can help you who are the people who will buy from you who are the people who can influence your career in one way or another when you know who those people are then you start working through your contacts to get to them and then you have a plan when you get there on what you want to say what you want to do how you might reciprocate back to them to make it worth their time and how you reciprocate to the people who would give you referrals people love to do things for other people in a way to either show that they're powerful or just because they have a do-gooder kind of na nature when you tap into that you get people who refer to you when you get 100 people who are your collectors and they're referring to you they can potentially in a career where you might make a thousand pieces over the course of 30 years for instance be responsible for selling a third or perhaps more of all of your originals right in a warm market of loyal people who love you who want to support you I'm not saying that selling direct is the only way to go I'm saying it is the number one thing and then you do everything else that you're doing as a way to layer on top of it to make even more money and solidify your career that's how you make yourself bulletproof. That 100 collectors means that you, if galleries come and go, if Facebook fades out of favor or whatever else you're doing, if you're marketing direct, you can take a hit from when one of your other distribution channels falls down. Getting all this done is not easy, I understand that, but having good time management skills gives you more time to get things done. I will show you some great tools in the book that you can implement that will help you understand how you're using your time 
and how to squeeze more time out of each week. Imagine having five or ten hours extra each week to work on marketing or making art. That's money in your pocket. You just need to be thinking about it intelligently so that you can wring that time out of your given schedule. We'll cover traditional tools, we'll cover digital tools. I will show you how to blend those into a, an effective marketing campaign that includes your website, a blog, email marketing. I believe you should have all three of those if at all possible. Definitely website and email marketing. And that you take all of these things, put them together into a master plan so that you know in any given day that you can look at your rolling 12-month calendar. This is what I'm going to be doing in three months, six months, 12 months. And here's what I need to do. Here are the steps that I need today to accomplish the things that might be happening in three, six, or 12 months. When you start breaking them down into very small increments, you make it to the point where nothing is overwhelming. Everything gets done because you're not taking huge chunks out of your time or um, fretting and worrying about things that needed to be done six months ago because you had them on your schedule, you had the time, you got them done in advance, and you took out all the stuff in your schedule that was really just a waste of your time and probably a waste of your money. By doing all that, you get here to the top, and that's where I want to see you. I want to thank you for taking the time to listen to this short presentation on what's in my book, and I certainly so hope to hear you hear from you when you do get to to the top.